Hello everybody, Basilisk Fang here and welcome back to Near Replicant. We are in the Baron Temple and we did a whole bunch of challenges to get to this point in the temple, but since it just gave us a safe point, I'm sort of leaning towards that there's going to be a lot more going on. I mean, I could check a map, I guess. This map actually doesn't tell me much. In fact, it might just be like a boss room or something. I don't know. I'm suspecting that there's a lot more to this temple, but maybe I'm wrong. What's this? It's a collapsed part of the temple? Oh, this doesn't look suspicious at all. I mean, if this temple is old, then no, it doesn't look suspicious. Oh, now that part, that's suspicious. When the door's shut behind you <laughs> automatically, that's that suspicious. It probably should be, but, hey, you know, I'm just getting look. warmed up. Hey, the prince! There's a lot of epic music going on. I'm not 100% sure why yet. Oh, he's gonna get crushed to death down there. Bye, Prince. Oh, hello. All right. Um, yeah, so do I just shoot at these? I guess I don't understand what I should be doing. So I'll shoot this one because it's within range. There we go. So I'm guessing I just have to shoot things and not get, you know, killed in the process. And then we shoot you. There we go. This is working pretty well. It's working pretty well. Hit the bottom ring. All right, so the bottom ring is down. Okay, so we just attack this. That's easy enough to do with my, oh, I could destroy the boxes too, that's helpful. All right, dodge, dodge, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. I keep getting hit because I don't know how to dodge. All right, so every time a glowing cube comes by, all right, see, I'm gonna die. See what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying here? All right, that's that row down, but I gotta heal. Recovery, uh, I have a lot of medicinal herbs. We're just gonna stock up on that, there we go, good enough. Interesting, this ring is slower than the other rings. That's a different sort of change of pace. It's actually really easy because of the strategy I'm using where I just shoot rapidly at it. Just blow everything out of the way and then hit the the cube. We almost got it, we almost got it, we almost got it. There we go, that's down. One more ring. It's gonna be a fast one. It's gonna be a fast one. All right. I might need to employ a different strategy for this because this is not working. Nope, never mind, I got one. All right, I'm gonna die though, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna keep dodging, but I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Okay, he's going a little too fast for my bullets to get. Maybe if I just rapid fire? There we go, I finally got it. Jeez Louise. I had to throw in some uh, sword moves there. I really should heal, but I don't want to miss this cutscene. Oh, ho, 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 it's a big guy. It's a big guy. Hi. Um, hmm. All right, his hands glow. Dodge the hands. Nope, get smushed by the hands. I see how this is gonna go. All right, uh, those are not glowing. How do I, ow. None of those were glowing. I guess I don't know how I'm supposed to fight it if they never glow red. This is a powerful foe. There you are, you bastard. Hey, Kaine. Kaine. Welcome back. I'm gonna kill the shit out of you. No, hold still and die already. She's very, very foul mouthed. I don't know if that was what you were expecting to do. Were you expecting to do more damage than that? I mean, it can heal itself. I don't know if I mentioned that before. Maybe if you, like, consulted with me instead of just, like, jumping in, we could work something out, you know? All right, so now do you want to strategize? Beats me. I just kicked okay, a dodge, 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 dodge. Okay, so now they're glowing red. I can get in here. There we go. Fuck off, book. Yeah, uh, Grimoire, this is not the time. the glowing cubes take priority. Screw your priorities! I'm gonna kill this thing my way! Awesome, I got all four of those. Shooting is definitely the way to go. Screw the sword. The sword is just slowing me down. Uh -huh. Now let's throw your fist and I jump. Oh, never mind. It didn't do anything. Beautiful. All right. Good stuff. Good stuff. Now what? Kane, where the hell are you shooting these beams? Are you trying to hit me? Okay, they're in the corners. They're in the corners. I can rapid fire. Oh, shoot faster. It's turning into a bit of a two way bullet hell here. He's shooting at me. I'm shooting at him. One of us will be victorious eventually. All right, he's down to his last row. 
And so far it seems to be cooperating. I just stood there and took that even though I could have easily dodged it. Kainai's actually helping out quite a bit here. You go, girl. All right, what kind of badass move am I gonna do to finish this off? Oh, I'm just gonna do the regular old spear thing. All right, that's fine, that's cool, that's cool. It makes sense, it's a distance enemy. Nice. All right, is he done for? I mean, his health bar went to zero. I don't want him coming back like that one shade. Hey, you made it. Yay. Is that his mask? <laughs> I like the deliberate Legend of Zelda ripoff there. <laughs> hey, we found you, Prince. I think a reward is in order. Yuri, Ah, the royal mask. Our people have suffered since the king's death. I was too young to bridge the gap between our people and other civilizations. Trade has come to a halt. We lack food and water, and people despair for it. This mask is an emblem of the king. With it, I can protect a strong image of our other two other lands, and our people can be prosperous once more. My prince, rules do not exist to bind you. They exist so you may know your freedoms. Those are the words of the previous king, my father. And now that I have his mask, I believe I can ascend to the throne. Is this correct? Of course. Hail! All hail the new king! Oh good, the king's a child. So, uh... I believe some sort of reward is in order. I apologize to you, my foreign friends, for all your hardships. I swear by my new position as the king of facade, I shall grant whatever you desire. Oh good, I want everything. Please, what is it I can do for you? Oh, no, that's all right. We were just happy to help. Nonsense. Speak your desire that I may see it done. Yeah, there's, there's no time to be selfless. I believe the regent has just given us an order. I guess so. In that case, how about you make rule zero and have it say that if people don't like a rule, they can vote to change it? A splendid idea. I mean, I thought we were going to make like a wish for ourselves, but you know. Very well. What? But my king, this cannot be. Our people have long memories. We shall never forget the debt we owe you, no matter how hard the times. Such is the way of the masked people. And thus, we shall grant your request. Still, that alone cannot repay our debt to you. I mean, it was a pretty big ask. Please, accept this. The one-handed sword rebirth. Oh, I've, I've been, you know, Thanks. thinking about getting stronger but swords. Your praise belongs to someone else. I don't know if that sword is any stronger, but uh, I hope it is. Thank you, Freya. Or Fyra? I don't remember her name. Thank you, Fira. I'm sorry for all I put you through. It's not a problem. All right, well, before we proceed any further, I want to check out this new weapon. Let's see, rebirth is a very light weapon, and it's stronger? No, I read it backwards. It's a very light weapon, but it's weaker, I see. It's, I mean, the columns all line up and I'm just stupid. But if I take the words and add them to it, that might work. So if I go to rebirth and equip the best words, the attack power goes up and the item drop rate. I don't like the item drop rate one. It doesn't help me too much. I'd rather give it Salir because that gives it poison. All right, so now how does it compare? I see, it doesn't apply those effects to the comparison here. So they're actually got the same effects, but the Lily Leaf Sword is still a little bit stronger, but I'm wondering if the very light means it swings much faster. I think it's faster? I honestly can't tell. I should probably just figure out what the difference is between the weapon types. I'm gonna keep it equipped for now. We might change it depending on how things go. I also need to see if I can actually upgrade anything as I like gather more and more upgradable, like, well, things to upgrade with. Anyway, what do you got for me, Prince? Do you know how to cure the Black Scrawl? I mean, this kid? I don't know. So soon. Ah, the foul disease that claimed my father's life. So even a king couldn't recover from it. I mean, the king isn't immune. Ah. I fear everything we tried ended in failure. It seems there is no way around it. 
We'll have to collect the sealed verses after all. I assumed that would be the case. Yeah, it's the only lead we have. Pardon me, but what are these sealed verses? We came across an old song that says if we find them all, we can cure the Black Scrawl. And yes, we are well aware that refrains penned by minstrels half in their cups are hardly a reliable source of information. Hey, I'll believe anything if there's even a sliver of hope it could help me save Yona. That's why we're here in the first place. And I'll collect verses, orbs, crystals, magic goat meat, whatever. I bet we're gonna have to collect all those things at some point in this game. Alright, so what I'm getting from this is that this is all a huge waste of time. Can I ask you to visit us again? To return as friends? Of course. Just try not to get yourself kidnapped again. Of course. Thank you. I promise to be careful. Ah, uh, we got a sealed verse. Alright. Dark wall magic. Erect a magical defensive barrier. Charge to increase the size of the wall. I am not much for defense, and that's probably why I die a lot. Alright, can we finally leave now? Because I'm starting to get annoyed with the me trying to leave and the people trying to talk to me. But yes, he makes a good point. We should go talk to Yona. Take me back to the entrance, please. Actually, hold on. I want to check out the grocery store. If they got watermelon, I need watermelon. I mean, they got watermelon spread all over the place. Hi, you got watermelon? Mm-hmm. Aha, they do. And it's actually way cheaper than a regular melon. So we're going to take one of those... Hmm, should I just buy some of these just to have them? A gourd and a pumpkin just in case she asks for them? I'm probably wasting my money, but I don't want to come back here. Purchase it all. All right, now we got basically one everything except a melon, but she already had a melon, so I'm not buying her another melon. The boat guy also said that there was like a strange thing shop? A strange thing store. What sort of strange things are we talking about? Is it just going to be like random junk? Oh, he's got like signs and surfboards and stuff from the old world. That's interesting. As per rule 9102, I am responsible for the trading of strange and unusual goods. Uh, when I actually have them on hand. Ah, he doesn't have anything right now. All right, well, I'll check the weapon shop just to cover my bases, but I think we're about ready to go. So basically everybody sells Beast Bane, which is kind of interesting, but they also have the Earthworm's Claw. Made from the fossil of an ancient beast, it's more unwieldy than most swords, but further forging can help. Interesting. So it's a very heavy weapon. I'm wondering if it's possible to take heavy weapons and turn them into light weapons with the forging, so then you get their power, but they're not slow. I'm just sort of guessing. Anyway, I'm not going to worry about buying that right now. Alright, we're back at the entrance. I think it's time to go. Uh, and go check on Yona, just like we said. You coming with, Kaine? Nope, I guess she's just going to stay here. Ah, I see you decided to come after all, Kaine. Good for you, good for you. Whoop, I hit a rock. I suppose rules are rules, even if they are absurd. I don't think they're absurd. Oh. Surprise, Those surprise. The hero me. and the book disagree on something. I don't say. I do. And I think it's important we respect that. Well, well. The boy is beginning to sound like a man. Boy? I'm not a kid, you know. Hey, less talking, more walking. Hey, Kaine, you don't need to butt into this conversation. Sometimes this story progresses very quickly and sometimes it progresses very slowly, so I don't know what to expect when I get back to the village. Is it going to be normal? I'm going to go talk to Yona and she's going to be like, Hey, did you bring me a watermelon? Or is there going to be something bad happening? I mean, there could always be something good happening too, I suppose, but let's face it, that never happens. Oop, I'm sorry, I just noticed you had a quest. Is it something easy? Hey, you can get into facade, right? I've got a thank you gift I need delivered, and I'm hoping you can help me out. Is it fragile? It is fragile, gosh darn it. Great. Oh, and it's kind of fragile, so don't roll around or get knocked over along the way, alright? I can't make any promises. Just get that to the weapon shop in Facade. And thanks again. Alright, I'm going to very carefully go talk to Yona first, but then we're probably going to deliver that just to get it off my plate. Oh, Yona, I'm home, and I brought you a watermelon. Yona? Oh, hey. How are you feeling? Better, now that I'm taking the medicine you brought. Well, that's good. Good. Um, by the way, are you going to stay here today? I mean, do you want me to stay here today? I'm... Uh, I can't say no to Yona. Sure, I'll stay. You bet. Yeah, Yona. I'll stay. We're not gonna make any money, but, you know. Yay! 
Uh, I can't say no to her. Now get back to bed. Yeah, go to bed. I'll sit here, but you're gonna be in bed. So what's the point of me sitting here? Okay. I hear a voice. I squint and see a boy standing before me. His hair is silver, his skin is pale, and he stares up at me with hard, glassy eyes. Soon his lips begin to move, but no sound comes out. What is he saying? I can't hear him. I can't hear him. I can't hear him. I can't hear him. I can't. I can't. I can't. I try to leave, but something about the boy holds my gaze. I watch his face, expressionless, as his lips slowly flutter. What is he trying to say? Wait, it's a phrase. I can almost make it out. It starts with an S, then there's an E. I can almost see it now. The letters begin to fall together, one after the other, faster and faster. Sealed verse. It's a sealed verse. The thing I'm looking for, the key to saving my sister. I stare at the boy with renewed ferocity, trying desperately to make out his next word. Dream. Dream? What? What the hell does that mean? The lips move again, faster now. I can't follow them. Damn it! I can't make it out. I want to scream. I want to tear the walls down around me. But instead, I force myself to be calm. I can do this. I can do it for Yona. Slowly, ever so slowly, I parse out the letters that make up his final words. Forest of Myth. The next morning! Just a dream. Yeah, just a dream. Even in my dreams, I'm hunting sealed verses. What's up, Yona? Morning. Morning. M morning, Yona. What's wrong? Are you feeling sick too? No, I just... I had a strange dream. What was it about? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Because I had a dream too. Oh yeah? Yeah, me and this boy were playing a game together. What kind of game? It was called Guess the Words. I think he made it up because I never heard of it before. Hmm. How did it work? The boy would move his mouth, but no words would come out. Then I had to guess what he was trying to say. It was hard. I wanted to play hide and seek, but we had to play his dumb game instead. Yeah, what a jerk. So what did he say? I don't know. All I could figure out was dream and forest of myth. What a coincidence. That's all I could figure out as well. But don't worry. I'm going to study hard so that next time I can figure out everything. We should play a game together sometime too. Sure, Yona. All right then. So I brought you a watermelon. Did somebody order a watermelon? Yay! You're the best. Oh, well. I try. Anything else you need? Actually, I need a pumpkin. Oh, well, I think it just so happens that I bought one of those. All right, then. One pumpkin coming right up. I got your pumpkin, Yona. Thanks. You've sure been eating a lot lately. Wait, is she eating these? Oh, I'm not. Okay, thank God. I was, that's a lot of food for a little girl. You're not? Ta-da! Here you go. I made it all by myself. Ah, Yona's cooking. Is this a cake? A pumpkin melon watermelon cake? Yep. Popola taught me how to bake one. Well, how much did Popola help you? I made it for you in secret. Wow, Yona. This is, um, well, it's a surprise for sure. Come on. Try it. Try it. Mm. Mm. Yeah, this is so good. Yay. You're always super busy, so I wanted to make you something to help keep up your strength. And instead, you made a cake that's probably going to kill me. That's really sweet of you, Yona. Thank you. Sure. Actually, I made like seven cakes, so there's tons of leftovers. Yay! <sighs> the life of an elder sibling continues to be a trying experience. Yeah, you're starting to appreciate this life I live here, Grimoire? You're telling me. Something troubling you, lad? It's nothing. Don't worry about it. Come on, I need to go ask Popola something. But first, we have a fragile delivery to make. 
Actually, you know what? Before we do that, I'm gonna look around the village and see if there's any other errands I need to run because if I have to make multiple trips to Facade, I'm not gonna be happy. Aha, uh -huh, here's somebody with a quest. What can I do for you? Excuse me, but have you seen my son? Uh, maybe? I don't think so. Why? Is something wrong? When I got home, I found a note from him that said he was leaving and not to look for him. What if he's left the village? Well, that's what leaving tends to mean. Please, you have to help me. I'll pay you whatever you want. Anything you say? My son shouldn't be too hard to spot. He wears a very odd hat. You can see it from a mile away. Like literally? Because that's a pretty big hat. Okay. If I see him, I'll let him know his father is worried about him. Alright, well I don't know if that has anything to do with facade, but uh, we have that quest now. Okay, I think the only other person with a quest is Devila, and she might just retell me about the one that's in Seafront. Oh, you want a different job? Well, can I not take more than one job? Which job should I give you first? Oh boy, the tangled message, item unknown, and apology from a fool? Apology from a fool sounds fascinating. Wait, what the heck? Seriously? Okay, so... Apparently, someone in Facade wants you to fix his broken marriage. Okay. I wrote down the client's location on your map, so head over there to get the details. Uh, okay, that's actually kind of helpful because I don't know where stuff is in Facade. So, basically, in the upper left-hand corner, but not in the exact corner, down a little bit. Near the middle. Basically on the left-hand side. Whatever, I'll find it. Okay, so I've definitely confirmed you can only accept one job from Devla at a time, but the other job required me to go to Seafront, and I have no reason to go to Seafront right now. So I replaced it with this one for Facade, and then I think we have enough time to run to Facade really quick, do these quests, and we'll call it a day. You want to try your hand at this job, Kaine? Are you serious? Hell no. <sighs> Percy's are only good for breaking things anyway. Ouch. We'll start with you. All right, Kaine, it's so sunny in the desert that I think our only worry is the wolves. I don't think there's going to be any shades, but the wolves are fast, so we're going to keep our distance. Thanks for your help. Hey, I leveled up to level 13. I forgot levels were a thing in this game. Oh, there are some shades out here. They just don't survive very long because they're in the sun. I probably should just make a dash for it. I don't know why I'm like even risking getting hit out here. Aha, you try to sneak up on my side, but I saw you on the map. And I'm not entirely sure how the map works in this game, by which I mean in Near Automata it made sense because we're like robots. We could theoretically have like radar and stuff and know everything that's going on around us and therefore draw a map. But in this, we're presumably What's regular that? old people. Whoa! Is a scorpion. Phylum Arthropoda, Subphylum Calicerata, Order Scorpionida. They are closely related in form and structure to other arachnids. I don't know why they gave me this fishing tip number two tutorial. I am so not following you right now. It's an enemy. Kill it. <laughs> now that <laughs> Way I ahead of you. <laughs> Alright, I forget where I'm supposed to take this package. Was it to the weapon shop? Yeah, the weapon shop, that's right. Alright, I'm gonna take the boat. That seems like the safest way of doing this. Very carefully. Drop Hi this there. off. I've got a parcel for you. For me? Oh, it's a thank you gift from the traveler that visited earlier. Thank you so much for bringing it all the way here. We better report back to the client. All right, that's done. Now let's go. Oh wait, you have a quest too. Hold on. Hey, you! I need you to get my idiot son back here, pronto. Another missing son? Whoa! Do you always start conversations like that? Ah. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm just so angry and worried right now. Please, forgive me. My son went to the desert alone. He's trying to build a name for himself and become a true man of the mask. Or what you outsiders call a soldier. He must be a reckless child indeed to venture into the desert alone. I need someone to bring him back before he hurts himself. Could you please help me out? Sure, we'll take care of it. Oh, thank you so much. Alright, well we'll keep an eye out for that, but it's not high on my list. So I believe somewhere on this side of town is somebody who needs my help? Because this way is north, right? Is it you? Haha! -ha. What's up? Pardon me, do you have a moment? What do you need? My daughter's been missing for a few days, and I was wondering if you'd heard anything. Oh, 
But we'd be happy to keep an eye out for her and let you know if we find anything. Does the girl have any identifying marks or scars? Hmm. Well, she's probably wearing her gold ring. It's a family heirloom I gave her a little while back, so I doubt she'd take it off. In any case, thank you very much. Alright, you're not the one I was looking for, but I'm glad to help you. There's actually quite a few people around here that could use my help. Hey, you want to do a poor schlub a favor? Wow, you sound pretty depressed. I've been cheating on my wife and she found out. Then she kicked me out of the house. I hope you don't expect sympathy from us. No, no, I've been a selfish idiot. I just want her to take me back, so I was hoping to give her a present. I want to make her a wolf hide coat, but I haven't been able to get the necessary materials. So you want us to hunt some wolves for you? I mean, I already have quite a bit of wolf hide. I don't know how much you need, though. That's the idea. Can I count on you? Depends how much you're gonna pay. Well, you seem to recognize that you messed up, so I suppose we can help. Thank you. I just need ten wolf hides. I don't know if I have ten of them. Yeah, I don't have ten. I have way less than ten. Alright, uh, since you're standing right here, I'm gonna ask you what you need. The girl who's gone missing? Well, last time I saw her, she was hanging around with her boyfriend. Oh, okay. I guess that's helpful information? Alright, so all these side quests are starting to stack up and they deserve their own episode, so I'm going to stop it here. Thank you everybody so much for watching, I certainly appreciate it. Make sure that if you like this video, you leave a like on it and make sure if you're not subscribed to the channel, you do that because there's more videos like this every single week, as well as other videos, uh, whether they be like sort of vlog type stuff or vine compilations that I've got on the channel and things like that. It's, uh, you know, whatever I feel like doing, so you got to be subscribed to make sure that you catch it all. Um, we're getting a little deeper into the story, but some of the story feels more like side quest. Like we heard a rumor that maybe we could find some help here and then you can't actually find help here. So it kind of feels like a waste of time, but it's also like helping with the world building. So I'm assuming we're going to do a bunch of these sort of weird side things to help flesh out the world and then the story is going to get going. But I honestly don't know. We'll figure out next week, I guess, in the weeks after that. Thanks again. And I'll see you guys all next time. Bye-bye.